Hey everybody, it's Ed. All right, my last video, I did a opening of a gift that I received in the mail. And today I received another gift. <laughs> and this one I, I um, have been waiting for also. Uh, this is from Kurt, who is a viewer. And um, we I've exchanged with him in the past when I had previously done a video at Infinity Records. Uh, there were a couple of things that he was interested in. I was lucky enough to be able to go back and get them for him. And it was around Father's Day, so I just sent them out to him and, and you know, said Happy Father's Day. So uh, I guess he felt that he wanted to repay me. So he sent me a gift, and I'm going to open it up. But before I do this, Kurt, thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. I already know what's inside. And... Um, yeah, so th this this saved me from having to uh, get it if if I ran across it. So what's in here? Let's open it up. Let us find out. All right. So excited because I know what it is. keep you in suspense what is in here what could it possibly be hmm guess we're gonna find out oh, oh what what's oh wait there's a note I gotta read the note Merry Christmas to you and my family I hope he hopes that I enjoy this LP Merry Christmas Kurt Kurt I assure you sir I am definitely going to enjoy this LP so what did I get let us slide it out and let us see. Are you ready? Uh, what do you think? Anybody? Huh? Anybody? Huh? Huh? Yeah? What? <gasps> Music on vinyl, promised land. Yes. Yes. All right, so here will be another addition to my music on vinyl collection. Oh, and it's numbered. It is numbered. I have number. <gasps> 1929. 1929. All mine. All right. Excellent reproduction of the album cover with my favorite Elvis album right there. Oh, man. Let's check this out. Music on vinyl, there is your hype sticker. Oh, we are opening this up, and we're going to check this out. All right, we have Music on Vinyl, Elvis Presley, Promised Land, limited numbered, edition 2500. Um, on transparent and white marbled vinyl, featuring the singles If You Talk In Your Sleep and Promised Land, 180 gram audiophile vinyl. There you go. All right, let us open this up. And let us see what is inside. Ooh. Oh man, this is so cool. Cover is very glossy. That's one thing I've noticed about the music on vinyls. They reproduce their covers on a very, very glossy type material. All right, and let's look at the inside. Ooh, comes in a nice black sleeve. Here are your labels. Well, you have side B on your RCA Victor orange label circa 1970s. Here is your side A. And let us check out what this vinyl looks like. You ready? Whoa, that is sweet looking. Nice. Look at this. Can you see? Yeah, look at that. I think it's showing up pretty nicely, at least what I can see. I'm trying to get it without the glare from the light. But yeah, that is really freaking cool. Oh yeah, no, no, I cannot wait to throw this on the turntable. And probably what I will do is um, maybe I shall do a little test comparison of, of an original pressing and this, and then uh, come back at a little bit later time and give you my thoughts on uh, similarities, differences, or whatever I can discern from listening to them. As the only variable I would change would be the albums. Everything else would be the same. Same turntable, same needle, same speakers, same receiver, same output. So 
this would be the only variable change, which would be the LPs themselves. So can kind of do a little controlled uh, testing. Come back with uh, my thoughts. So I will probably do that, but not as soon as you would like, I'm sure. <laughs> All right. But yeah, Kurt, I love it. I appreciate it. And I thank you very much. And I definitely will enjoy it. And, uh, if, you know, if you'd like, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. If you have this pressing, what your thoughts of the sound are. And uh, we'll leave it at that. All right. But again, thank you, Kurt. Good to yourselves. Good to each other. Take care.